so I would finish my Dragon Dragon Cape. I should not talk in crime, but I do this anyway because I'm a rebel. I'm just stupid. Phu Nok Bang National Park in central Vietnam is famous for its cards, mountains, and caves. Naturally, a jungle trek is a popular thing to do. I picked around and decided to join Jungle Boss for a day trip into the jungle. Hi, hi, Missy. Today Hello, I'm doing. Welcome to the jungle. Yes, today I'm doing the Mada Valley, Valley and Elephant Cave and Chang'an Cave. Yep. Trek tra, tra, tra. with Jungle Boss. So I'm really excited. So half an hour. Yeah. Bus to the start. Yay! Our day started with pickup to the Jungle Boss headquarters where we got kitted up, and our guide Messi explained the day's activities to us. Also, we got a ride in an old army jeep. Pretty cool, right? The jeep dropped us off at the trail start along Ho Chi Minh Trail with a steep initial hike down and then a flat trail. So after the shortest hike possible, we are at Trang Nang Cave. We're doing the reverse route of the usual route because there are like a group of us, two groups of us today, and we're geared up to go into the cave. We were given life jackets and hard hat with head torch, kept our shoes on and left our bags to go into the Trang An Cave. The cave only opened to visitors in 2016 for the tools run by Jungle Boss, and we are going to swim inside in darkness. It was a 300 meter swim inside, and then we turned off our head torch. Swimming in the Trang An Cave, which is super cool. And just look at everything around me. I thought the life jacket doesn't fit me, as always. Trang An Cave is absolutely stunning, but the trek in and out can be slippery on polished cast rocks. So, now we're gonna have tea and then get dressed again and then on to Moda, Moda, Moda Valley. We got back into our clothes and set off, crossing the river and on to more slippery rocks. We have set off from the Trang An Cave. We have 45 minutes walk to the Mada Valley and Lake. Um, this is kind of like a very rocky part. And I'm gonna eat it live by mosquitoes. Luckily, the trail took us into the jungle next, but not without some ups and downs. We're stopping for a break. Hi, Yong. He's our porter. So we're going up from the Mada Valley and then down again on some really steep rocks. It's just jungle now. Hot. Jungle trekking in July is sweaty business, but it also means that we get to cool off when we reach the Mada Lake. We have made it to the campsite. They're setting up for like our lunch. This is the Mada Valley, so people are swimming. Oh god, it's gorgeous. I'm gonna get some photos. You can cliff jump into the lake, but I just swam around before we get our delicious picnic lunch. It was make your own rain roll with rice papers, veggies, chicken, and rice and the phone are special dipping sauce. We had a really nice swim at the Mada Lake and um, ate lunch, really, really cool rice paper roll with rice. And now we're going ready to walk one hour, 45 minutes to the Elephant Cave. From Mada Valley to the Elephant Cave, there are some poison ivy along the way by the river, so we had to be careful, but the view is pretty good. We just got past the poison ivy which I reckon you can probably still do this in shorts and not die but it's nice if you have like protection so for apparently from the Mada Lake to the Elephant Cave it's a pretty easy hike until you get to about 10 minutes to the cave it might be like when we left from Trangan Cave so you yeah, nice but uh, I feel like this is an easy trek well, touch wood this part is the longest point to point trek of the day but pretty uneventful before long, we were back on the Ho Chi Minh Trail. We came out of the trail, and now we're on the Ho Chi Minh Trail, so concrete trail. We're on our way to the Elephant Cave, which is about 25 minutes away. The July sun was hot on our back, but the trail starts to the Elephant Cave is further along and also unexpectedly steep. We're climbing up to the Elephant Cave, and I regret thinking that this is not a workout. It's a steep. But it is 100% worth the hike up. Again, we left our bags and put on only the hard hat this time to walk over to the other side of the cliff. The other entrance is the turtle entrance with a beautiful jungle backdrop. 
We are just at the elephant cave. It is so pretty. I didn't end up taking my phone in there, so I didn't do any videos of myself talking. But basically, this um, they have a stalactite stalagmite that looks like a elephant, but also the guy who discovered it named means elephant in Vietnamese. Cool, isn't it? Then it was time to climb back out with the knowledge that they had cold drinks waiting for us at the jeep. So we just finished the hike. We went back up from Elephant Cave back to the Ho Chi Minh Chiro where our truck is waiting. A cold drink. Hi, bye, yeah. You know, right? Yeah. We don't know it. We don't know it. Let's see. Mod. Hi. Mod. Hi. Bye. Bye. Yo. Yo. Hi, bye, yo. And then we finish it. You got it. You got it. One shot. Are you ready? Yeah. Mod. Hi, bye, yo. Hey, what are you, why are you touching it? Very entrepreneurial. They found a tree branch too. 